Hi guys, right, this is a Sweet Child of Mine. We're going to look at the, uh, the solos in the song, not the main riff. Uh, lots of people already done this on YouTube and some good lessons out there. I'm going to look at the solos and the scales involved in playing this. First and foremost, this song is not, uh, they play it in D major, but the tuning is actually C sharp. Listen, if I just play the, uh, briefly play the track now. And that note is a mile out, so we need to detune it to C sharp. Okay, so that's the D string there. Once you've got that, tune everything up to that tuning, okay? okay. This song is in D major. Accept that notes and the solo in D major are going to be from the D major scale. <laughs> to play the first two solos in this song, we're not going to be using uh, this scale position, which is the Ionian, D Ionian. <laughs> Too awkward. We're going to have a look at the second mode in D major, which is E Dorian. Okay. What I'll do, I just want you to hear this. I'm going to play. I'm going to play E Dorian now. That works great over an E minor, but it is actually a D major scale. And I'll prove that by playing a D first, and then I'll do exactly the same E Dorian scale. So here we go, there's D, now E Dorian. Yeah, I played the E Dorian scale there, I just started on D and I finished on D. And you heard that D major scale. Okay, so E Dorian effectively is D major. We're just going to use this scale because um, with the solos in this, it makes them a lot easier to play and you can get a lot more effect and uh, more techniques. Okay, so let me show you this scale now, E Dorian. So, and once you've got this, uh, it's going to be a lot easier for you to remember where notes are. I'm not just going to show you where to put your fingers, I want you to understand where this is coming from, this solo. Okay, so here's E Dorian. Okay, finger one, twelfth fret, E string. Sorry, let me just show you. Thumb. This is looking at your palm of your fretting hand. Thumb. One, two, three, finger four, little finger. Okay, one, fret twelve. Three, um, fret fourteen. So get that in your head. And that is on the D string, the eleventh fret, finger one, twelfth fret, finger two, fourteenth fret, finger four. Okay, onto the G string, and you just repeat that. So here we go. Now it repeats again. Okay, so B string now, finger one, twelfth fret, finger three, fourteenth fret, and finger four, fifteenth fret D, and repeat that. So we've got some repeating strings there, this is how I remember this scale. So if we start from the beginning.
playing that scale. Okay, right. First solo. I'll play it for you. on the G string and then play the G 12th fret G string all on the G string slide down slide down one fret so to my right hand down Starting with an upstroke. Okay, that is the E, 14th fret D string with finger three. So. And now for the bend. What I'm doing is uh, still in the same position. I'm playing the A on the G string, 14th fret, finger 3, and I'm bending up to the B. So A, up, down, and play the G, 14th fret, sorry, 12th fret G string. Then I'm coming back. I'm going to the D string, which is the 15th fret B string. And I'm playing that with my little finger. And now I'm going to play the D, but I'm going to transfer it from the fourth finger, finger four to finger three, because I'm going to do a bend. You never bend with your fourth finger if you can help it. Then with finger one, play the 11th fret on the G string, which is the G flat or F sharp. I'll do that again, nice and slow. Here it is again. So, okay, let's go back to guitar for a go. I'll sort of slow it down to half speed.
recap that's the first solo with the D tune to C sharp okay uh, the scale is E Dorian which I want you to learn is this again <laughs> Actually is uh, its mother scale is D major, and I'll prove that to you now. I shall play D. Now I'm going to play E Dorian. You should be able to hear that D major scale. Do, re, mi, fa, sol, la, ti, do. So D. Now I'm going to play E Dorian. E Dorian is D major. The song is in D major, so any notes we play in E Dorian are going to work. And the E Dorian position is where we do the solo. Okay, next lesson, I'm going to look at uh, the next part of the solo. Um, so, thanks for looking, practice the scale, try and understand where all the notes are coming from. Thanks for looking.